Yo, what's up, bitches? This is Dark Souls 3. Dark Souls 3! So I already got my Chloe Price. I already beat the game. But Billy and I, we figured we're gonna kind of do a little bit of a joint effort here. 420. Yeah. 420. <laughs> 420. So we're gonna do a new game. And I actually have PlayStation Plus, so we can get all the messages and shit. Oh. Well, I yes, indeed. Don't think we really need them. I don't really think we need them either. It's called Lathric. So out of all the Souls games, what's your favorite? I don't know. I really like this two, one. Two, definitely not. Definitely not two for me as well. I, I really like this one, though, because I was really into the Bloodborne. And yeah. this kind of had a little bit more... It kind of catered to like the Bloodborne style of play a little bit more. Personally, but, my favorite uh, out of all these is still Demon Souls, even though it's I would, I would say I would say so too. Like Demon Souls, there's really something special about yeah. that game. It, it was just like just watching that whole. Oh, that guy's dead. Just um, like just watching it unfold. It, I've never seen that kind of game before. Yeah, and then Dark Souls. I had a you know I had so much fun with Dark Souls. I never really got super far into that one. I yeah, I think that was the I hardest one. I think that was the hardest one out of all of them, personally. Yeah, because it's clunky. It's clunky and unfair. Yeah. And then number two, I didn't play that much. And this one, I wouldn't say is very clunky or unfair. No, this they, one's pretty. They definitely fix this one up. Yeah. This is definitely like probably the best made one out of all of them, I would say. But I think it's also kind of because of the fact that they. Uh, really got this game down to like a science now like where yeah. they can pretty much just churn them out um willy nilly you know I th and I also kind of felt when I was playing this one that the game was like the series is kind of getting a little tired yeah as it was going on like this game is still fantastic I am glad that this is the last one though but yeah I definitely think they need to move on to something different now I can see them you know doing another Bloodborne but I would say the second one should be the last Bloodborne also yeah Bloodborne's really not that far outside of the realm of this Souls games yeah it's basically the same thing with just more emphasis on combat yeah like straight up uh, assault yeah if anything, this was kind of more of a return to form to uh, Dark Souls 1, sort of. Yeah. Did they really have, like, an intro, an intro like this in Dark Souls 2? I don't remember. I don't think they did, did they? I not like Not, like, highlighting all the different, like, you know, creatures you're going to fight. Yeah, but this kind of thing here? Yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember. I know, because Dark Souls 1 did. Yep. You know, well, Demon's Souls, Demon Souls did, too. Yeah. Showed you Grave Lord Magneto. Yeah. Uh, Seek the Scaleless. Mm-hmm. You know, all those people. Yep. But yeah, no, I... This one's good. I really do like this one. I would say it's probably on par with number one, but number one, for me, uh... I, just like I got way, more into it. I just like the way that this one plays better, yes, obviously. Yes, yes, this one plays a lot better. Because I think really what made it different was, like, um, the older games made it a little harder for you to like actually have like rolling in your kind of move set. Mm -hmm. Rolling was almost like kind of like a last ditch sort of thing, you know. Because yeah. it's like I don't think I don't. If I recall, it didn't keep maintain your lock on when you were rolling. Um, maybe, I don't believe it did. Maybe unless it's. I think uh, it did if it was big enough and all that. Yeah. But you, you would lose it. So I think. Easy. All right. So I made I made Chloe Price. I think we should make Victoria Chase. What do you think? I disagree. Who do you want? Um, uh, 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 well, I can do that. Greg Astera. Greg Astera. Yeah, Greg, Greg Astera. Okay. I don't know who that is. How do you spell that? I don't know. Fuck Greg Astera. Right. Um, <laughs> oh, God. I'm saying that's like I model my characters after people from Life is Strange. So. Yeah, I, I don't. I, I just uh, <laughs> Tina Sanders. All right, that's our go-to. How is she looking these days? Do you know? <laughs> Tina Sanders. Yeah, how is she looking? <laughs> no clue. All right. Is that like a porn actress or something? Well, let's, let's, yeah, we gotta <laughs> figure out what she looks like. Um, uh, she's she's definitely an Astoria noble. Okay. I don't really feel like tweaking it more than that, other than her haircut. So, <laughs> yeah, let's let's give her. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's the only thing that really matters is her haircut. Uh, uh, 
uh, physical. Yeah, body nope, hair. that's body hair. Head. Face detail. Uh, facial hair. hair. There we go. Hair and facial hair. There we go. What are we looking at? Um, she she's definitely uh, a Tina. So what would you expect to Tina? Definitely a Tina. That right looks there. like a Tina there. That's, That's just got to be a louder color. Yeah, it's got to be much louder. Uh, let's just look through the rest of it here. Uh, I don't mind that one. That one's actually yeah, but no, nah, I kind of like the other one more. Yeah, it's got more personality to it. That one's not too bad. Yeah, it looks but... more like a fucking anime character. Yeah. Hmm. It looks like the dude from Baby Metal. <laughs> <laughs> I think I like that first one. It's fiery. Yeah. Let's make it like. Let's make it a bright color. Like Let's give it some bright, pop. like ready orangey oh. sort of thing. Oh, I can do change by ten. Yeah. Still. Yeah. I kind of like that that bright red one that you, it was. Yeah, drop that green down a bit. Put a little blue. Yeah, that's a nice color. It's like right in like yeah, there. Yeah, How's right that there. Look? That looks great. Yeah, that looks good. All right. Okay. What about her eye color? Uh, pooples. black like my soul. Pooples. Color of pooples. <laughs> black, black nah, like my soul. I think it's got to match. Yeah. All yeah. right. Cool. She got a tattoo on her face. Sure. Um. I don't really think she needs a tattoo on her face. No. Uh, yeah, right there. <laughs> Can you, where can you put... Oh, here we go. Yeah, up, down, left, right. It's like she has a crosshair. Well, you know, you make it big enough. Oh, you can make her like kitty. <laughs> kitty face. Now you make it big enough and you put it down low. Down low. Yeah, now she looks like she's... uh Yeah, right there. That looks perfect. Perfect! Alright, now we gotta roll our shit. What are we doing? I usually do night. I did depraved on mine. Okay. But, you know, that Maybe just... we can make a compromise here. Uh, let's go night. Because <laughs> I ended up as a night anyway. Okay. You want to do night? Yeah. All right, we'll do night. I like the nights. What are we doing? Um, Let's see. I did uh, fucking... I think it was life ring. Yeah, life yeah. ring is actually pretty good for the beginning. Uh, sure, you get one later, but that's I think much that's later. That's pretty much it. Yep. All right, let's do it. Tina, Tina Sanders. Sanders. She's our girl. If she can't do it, fuck you. <laughs> Taylor's the first one to play. Yeah, I'm pl we're gonna do a little bit of like an alternating thing, I guess. So like, if I die, then give it to Billy. We might just swap between episodes, even if we want. Yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll, we'll we're both gonna be playing this game. Because it's a good game, and I like it. You're used to it with the controller, too, right? Yes. Okay. I, that's all I played it on with Perfect. the computer. Perfect. <laughs> because the mouse and keyboard settings are ass. Yeah, I think in a game like this, you definitely need a little bit more uh, fine control over manipulating your character around the environment. Yeah. Eight minutes deep. We haven't played the game yet. Nope. That's, that sounds about normal. Yep. Oh, my God. This... Uh... This armor's heavy. Yeah. What happened last night? Oh, I shouldn't have drank that many mics. <laughs> How many mics we got in here, Billy? How many? Is that 23? Yeah, like 20. We are drunk. <laughs> Woo! 23 Let's each. Do it. I'm going to rack this guy. Oh, yeah, and I got the fading HUD because I think that's a cool feature. Yeah, yeah. You did. <laughs> you did, son. You did. Is there even anything over there? I couldn't remember. I don't remember, but it's yeah. a good idea. Good idea to check out all this shit. I thought there was a guy over here. No, too. Nope. no. Sort of a blue ba doo. All right. <laughs> blue ba doo. Yeah, I ain't playing that shit. Shit. Yo, dude. Yo, man. Fuck up, man. How you doing? So basically, like at this point in the game, it's just go fight the boss. Yep. Like, there's really no. The only thing to do here is kill the crystal beast. Oh yeah, if you want. I'm not gonna try and do that right now. They fuck you up. Hmm. I killed it. With my depraved. So, I'm I'll just save, saying. I'll, I'll save it for later. I don't want to give up the controller just yet. Because <laughs> I actually... It's been a long, It's been a little while since I played this game. It's yeah. a fun game, man. Yeah, me too. It's been, it's been some time. It's been a, been a hot minute. 
The last time I was playing, I was fighting against the uh, Pontiff Solivan. Yeah, that guy sucks. He's a fucking asshole. That was the only one that I think I used to summon on. That was the only, literally the only boss in the entire game I summoned on. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, ghost. I'm a ghost. I think, yeah, I did with the Abyssal Watchers, too. No, I didn't, I didn't summon for anybody but Pontiff Solivan. That was the only one. That guy's a bitch. Yeah, she's a fucking asshole. Yeah, that guy sucks. Yeah, because you can't... Yeah, you can't level up till you get inside there, so... Yeah. Basically, just go fight the boss. There's really not... Like, yeah. there's no grinding to be done here. I mean, unless you want. Yeah, which... It, it's slow, so don't. I, I wouldn't recommend it. There's really no point. Yeah, I miss that fucking... Fucking damn it. <laughs> I miss doing that every fucking time for, the, for a while. I'm like, god damn it. I just keep missing. Yeah, the only thing left, I think, are firebombs down there. Yeah. Whoopsie. Ooh, he backhanded. Actually, now he forward. Wait, do I have my, uh... I think I do. Hmm. My life ring? Yeah, my life ring's on. That just gives me more life. Yeah. Just little, a little bit. A little bit. A little touch. Touch of the life. A touch too much. Should I... I, I yeah, I think, I think you're right, though. I think that is, like, firebombs down that way. Yeah. Ooh, a titanite shard. That'll be, that'll be handy. Yeah, the, the lizard gives you a titanite scale, so you can get yep. some early, early powerful weapons. Yep. You could just jump down right there. Yeah, but I'm gonna be careful. Yeah, I can understand that. Also, there's another guy with a fading soul to the right. Over here? Yeah. Oh, yeah, there he is. At least he always gave me a fading soul. I'm not sure if he will. Nope, I was just lucky. Fading soul. I remember this area. That ain't worth well. shit. Nope, it's where, it's where 50. Yep. Which is t five arrows. Depending on the arrow. You're dead, son. Yep, yeah, firebomb. There we go. Not really worth it, but whatever. We'll take yeah, it. well, it's good for the uh, second level of the boss. Because they're yeah. weak against fire. Oops. Yes. Oh, down. down. Oh, do that. Why not? Don't do me like that. I don't think I can. Oh, yeah, I can't either. Hmm. <laughs> Adjust how many uh, flasks I have. Oh no! Oh, what up with that? Uh, it's the people talking on the fucking thing again. I learned rest. All right. I just figure I might as well just try and get there without wasting any health. Yeah. Bitch. Yeah, fight through that guy. Yeah, the bitch. Right here. Jump down on this guy's face. Hi yo. You did. Was there a demo for this game when it initially came out, or I think there was probably. like a promotional copy that they sent out to Let's Players or something? Yeah, probably. All right. Don't blow me like that. Don't we'll blow see. me like that. It's kind of like crapshoot sometimes if you can beat this guy in your first try or not. But yeah. you know, this guy's not too hard. You score can start yeah, yeah, you can Start get score some free hits on him. This ain't no ape escape boss, man. <laughs> Dating arms. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I'm saying. This ain't no ape escape boss. It's the fat one. It's the big yellow fat one. Yeah, this is the easiest part of him. This first bit? Yeah. Yeah. You know, just be wary of what's happening. And then, you know, he gets into this one. And it's not that hard, but no. he can be a pain in the ass. It's just kind of intimidating, the first thing. Oh, yeah. Know? Like, this is, like, one of the earliest guys you fight. And he's huge. Yeah. There we go. There you go. Yeah, I got this bitch. That's it right there. Yep. You're done. You're done, son. You're fucking done. Oh. <laughs> you just, you just <laughs> shit, just shit out his ass. 
<laughs> I just like that noise. <laughs> now go fight the crystal lizard. Okay. Since you can always get your souls back now. It'd be super easy. Oh. Oh. I can't travel yet, can I? Nope. All right. But you're going to fight the crystal lizard next time on Chin Strap Chat. Yeah. Because we fucking, like, you know, the first eight minutes of the fucking episode was just menus and cutscene. All right. First episode's always longer, Billy. You All know right. the fucking rule. I'm just saying we never made a rule. <laughs> That's always kind of been the rule. Yeah, it's kind the of. The unwritten been. rule. The unwritten rule. I'll have it, like, fake seek into the ending, and then it'll be like, fuck you. <laughs> Piece of shit. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, let's let's make Billy look like an asshole. No, I'm not trying to make you look like an asshole. It's just the first episode's always longer. Yeah, because like all this intro bullshit. I mean, at least we got through the first boss on the in the first <laughs> yeah, in the first episode. try. Yeah, the dude's not that hard. No, you know you know but what the thing you know what the thing is too is like I've actually kind of wonder like thought about this a little bit too is like um, you know, you and I kind of like pick these sort of characters because that you know you can kind of like dominate certain enemies and stuff like that. Pretty yeah. Easily. You, you normally can dictate the uh, flow of the battle. Yeah, but, like, I remember uh, the guy, my friend at the studio. Um, he was mage, He right? was mage, and it's, like, in a way, I remember some other people, like, making the argument that, like, that's kind of like choosing your difficulty in this game. Because, mm -hmm. like, yeah, it took him, like, way, way longer to beat this game as opposed to me. And it's, like, maybe I am picking easy mode, but it's, like, I'm trying to pick the most dominant strategy that'll, like, defeat these enemies. That's kind of what my idea is. Yeah. Not so much that I'm trying to, like, you know, make it, you know. You can do cheap. a crit on him when he's like that. Oh, can I? Yep. I don't know that. Yep. But you have to do it in his face. Okay. It's like that. Yeah. Oh, uh, no. You bitch. You fucking bitch. You Beatrice. Yeah, right in there. Boom! Oh! It's more like in the grundle. Yeah. Alright. There you go, son. You did. Tight not scared. Bitch! Man, we're gonna make mincemeat out of this fucking game. <laughs> Except for when you get to the fucking Ithril dungeon area. That shit. Yeah, fuck that place. That's always like the... I hate that place. Ah, that just sucks. I'm just gonna, you know, be a pain in the ass and then just, just sap all your freaking life for no reason. <laughs> and then one little tiny, like, anything will kill you. You stub your toe and you're dead. Yeah. I walk down the thing and uh, there's like a, a slight little jagged piece of metal. Tetanus dead. Yep. Instantly. It would be. <laughs> you fucking cough and you die. It just... <coughs> <laughs> it's, a solid, it's a solid snake. <laughs> <laughs> What's that giant tree for? Because there's always a giant tree in these games. It's the tree of life, dog. It's actually really crazy, like how well they manage to like make these games. Because mm -hmm. it's like they're so consistent with them. Because it's like they just look. Look at this shit. Yeah, it's a big like look at how tree. look like look at how well this is all designed. And it's like they just do that like a year after like the, a game like this was already fucking made. Yeah, they're just like it's fucking, fucking man. crazy. <laughs> and you know what? Part of me kind of feels like if they just kept making games like this, like part of it would be all right because it's like, dude, all these games are cool, all these games are great, but at the same time, it's kind of like, yeah, it's kind of the same thing. Yeah. Kind of more of the same thing. I don't know who that broken straight sword's for. I don't know. Because even the Depraved's fucking club is better than that shit. Yeah, I was actually surprised when I first played this, because I picked a Depraved at first as well. But then I kind of didn't really like it pretty early on, just because I think it definitely... it Well, it gives you a higher difficulty curve. Yeah. Um, that is that is who I started and have continued to play on. Yeah. Is my Depraved. But, um... Uh, yeah, but I was actually really surprised at how effective the club was, too, because the club does more damage than my sword does against Goondir. Yeah. The whole thing with the club is that, uh... Slow. Yeah, it's slow. Also, your wooden plank... Oh, yeah. You... Shit. If you get hit, you're, you're still taking damage. Yep. So, when I was fighting him, 
as my depraved as hell. <coughs> I just never got hit. I ran. Oh, I yeah. ran and I dodged. Well, and the fact is, is that you're so light that you can dodge. Yeah. Hello. You tend to fire and you level me up. So that's what we're doing. What are we doing here, Billy? Um, I would probably say... I'd say I vote endurance. Yeah. At least one. Endurance, probably a bigger and a vitality. Vitality is really important. Vitality. Well, we should get it started now. Yeah. I vote just doing that because vitality yeah. is like really, really good. Do it. Actually. It will help us much later. And now that we, we got it, you know. <coughs> it'll just. <coughs> oh, damn it. Hmm. You alright? Yeah, just coughing. That's a buck fifty right there. That is a buck fifty. Let's do it. Man, if we start off now with uh, Vitality, we won't have to do it later. Yeah. We well, can always it, be it, light. It, well, and it helps. It's yeah. That's like the most important thing, I think, to upgrade is in this game is Vitality, because your defense fucking goes crazy up, too, when oh, you yeah. fucking upgrade that shit. Look, we're already at 99. Yeah. And yeah, we can already get 60 pounds worth of stuff. Mm -hmm. Why would you not do that? Hey! All right, we're going to go over here. <laughs> Just, <set it. laughs> Just Hey! Well, nice to see you. Well, okay. <laughs> nice seeing you. I just want to do my ash and... No, not uh, reinforce. Just... Uh, yeah. yeah, do that. Because we don't need any magic. Don't need no magic. Fuck you. Ah! Next time I just <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> We'll be back.